Hello, and welcome to this focused video tutorial on navigating the parent portal. In this lesson, you will learn about your portal page, your access to real-time attendance and assignment alerts, portal messages, your students' grades, attendance, and more. The portal screen is the first screen you will see when you log into Focus. At the top, you have the district logo that acts as a home button, returning you to this portal screen whenever it is selected. Next is your first and last name that is hard-coded into the header. Next is the school name, which is also hard-coded into the header. This will display your student's school depending on the student you have selected. Then is the school year pull down that allows you to navigate between current and prior future years. Then is your students' names. If you have multiple students in the district, you are able to switch between your students using this pull down. The marking period pull down displays all available periods during the school year. It defaults to the currently active marking period. Then you have your menu options, which allows you to navigate to different screens within Focus. Note that we will come back to these buttons later. In the Feature Program section, you will see a list of your students' classes along with the current grade. Clicking on the percent grade link or the class title will open the assignments and grade screen for the student's class. There you will see the assignments, the points earned, the grade, the date it was assigned and the date due, the category of the work, and the date the grade was last modified. In some classes, the categories are weighted differently, so at the top you will see what percent of your child's grade is attributed to that category, and an overall class grade. Going back out to the list of your students' classes and checking the box, select teachers to message, next to the teacher's name, will open up an email screen which allows you to send an email to the teacher. The Messages section will display any messages that have been pushed out to you by your student school or by the district. The Alert section will display any alerts specific to your student such as absences or upcoming assignments. These alerts also act as quick links to more information about the subject. The Upcoming Events displays the instructional calendar of upcoming events. Click on View Calendar to view the calendar for the entire year. The calendar will default to the current month and you can get more information about an event by clicking on it. In addition, you can use the pull downs to view prior or future months and years. The magnifying glass at the bottom left corner of the screen allows you to type in text to help you find specific menus in focus. The help link 
provides you with contextual help for the screen you are on and links you to Focus University help documents for that screen. The logout link will log you out if selected. Focus does time out after 60 minutes of inactivity. Next are the menu options that are available on your portal screen. Now we will return to the top of the page to go over the menu items including school information, my child, my information, assignments and grades. If you click on any of these buttons, you will see a search bar that works in the same way as the magnifying glass we covered for you at the bottom of the page. Clicking on the school information button opens up a pull down menu. Selecting portal will take you to the main portal screen. Clicking on calendar will take you to the same calendar page we showed you earlier. The My Child menu allows you to review your students' grades, absences, and progress monitoring information. The Absence Summary menu will take you to your students' recorded absences. On this screen, you will see the total number of periods that your student has been absent. A list of all the district's attendance codes, total number of days school has been in session, total number of full days that your student attended, total number of full days absent, as well as your student's enrollment date. At the bottom, you will see a list of dates. These dates represent the dates that your student received a code other than present for any one period of the day or received a comment on their attendance. When you hover your mouse over the code, you will receive more details, such as the class, the period and teacher, as well as information about when the code was entered and who entered that information. The progress monitoring screen will display any of your students' progress monitoring results if they were present for these assessments during the current school year. These assessments assist teachers in assessing students accurately and efficiently so that they can provide appropriate instruction and monitor their progress. My Information menu allows you to configure your preferences as well as update your portal password. The Preferences menu defaults to the Display Options tab. This tab allows you to edit the language that your portal screen will display in, change your highlight color, determine if you want your menu options to display at the top or the side of your screen, and decide how you want the date to display in focus. The Password tab next to the Display options allow you to change your current password. The Assignments and Grades menu lists all the classes that your student is enrolled in. Click on the class that you wish to view. Note that this is the same screen that can be accessed by clicking on the Grade Link screen for the course in the Featured Programs box on your portal page.
This concludes the video lesson on the Parent Portal. In this video, you learned how to navigate the Parent Portal as well as your different menu options and the information you can access through these menus.